I am here representing the city of Fort Worth, Fort Worth City Council District Number Eight, and I want to come and bring my uh, strength and support to this family. Uh, we have been supporting this family ever since this tragedy has happened. The city of Fort Worth and Tarrant County have come a long way, but we have a long way to go. We have to change our general orders. There is no way that he should ever came to this house with that same motive. We have to change our police in the, in the city of Fort Worth. And that's a hill that we're going to have to climb. But we cannot allow this trial to end and us to stop. We have to continue. We need you to still come down to city council. We need you to come down to Tarrant County. Because this fight is bigger than me. It's bigger than Tatiana. It's bigger than Lee. It's bigger than Ashley. This is an issue that has happened all over this, the United States of America. But we can make a change here in Fort Worth. We must. There are some things that the city is working on to, that we can honor her life. We've been on a gag order. We haven't been able to say anything. We haven't been able to candidly talk about how wrong this police officer is. But now we can. And so there are serious conversations that's going to take place with the help of this family, with the help of organizations, you know, United for Worth and other organizations that are here that's been on the front line fighting for justice. We haven't got exactly what we want, but we got something. And here in the black community, we're tired of just getting the short end of the stick. We want the same piece of the pie that the West Fort Worth get, North Fort Worth get. And I guarantee you, as long as we can sit on city council and we have representation, we're going to work to get that done. And so today, I don't have many words, but I'm just here to support this family and yet praying for Zion and the others who are affected by this tragedy.